All right, ladies, speaking of awards, the 95th Academy Awards took place last night, and fans were rooting for Angela Bassett to bring home the award for Best Supporting Actress. But unfortunately, that award went to Jamie Lee Curtis. Were you ladies disappointed? Selena, let's start with you. Oh, did we lose Selena? Yes, we did. Oh, okay, we did. let's start with Vivica. Vivica, what do you think? Okay, darlings. Now, first of all, let's just talk about it real quick. I'm going to make my points real quick. That purple magenta dress she had on, she looked stunning with the Bagari diamonds just dripping. She looked fabulous. Just, oh my God, look at her. Looking wow. like a movie star. Now, let's get to the tea. Because baby, Angela, and all of us had the same face when they did not call her name. That no, she didn't you she didn't play it off. Most people, you know, when they don't win, but they was hoping they won would give <laughs> the fake clap, right? Angela went. Sure mm. did. Sure and I'm gonna tell you something. I was at my table at Byron Allen's event, and my face did the same thing. Now, nothing against Jamie Lou Curtis. I like her. You know, her she's she's Hollywood. You know, royalty as far as with her father and the mother both being nominated as well, too. However, best supporting actress in my mind, 100 percent should have went to Angela Bassett. Her performance in Wakanda I, she, was stunning. It was so amazing, Claudia. I went to go see it and Lisa Ray two days in a row because I could not believe the depth. I've seen Angela Bassett do all kinds of roles, Mama, uh, the 911 show, and that all of that. The Queen Mother in Wakanda, too. That was Oscar. I called it that. I was like, Oscar, okay, I'm done. I'm, I'm, I'm going to say I felt she was robbed. I say the same thing. We were together, Vivica, when we saw Angela. When she came up on that screen, when you have a presence, that's something you can't buy. That's something that someone can't teach you. She has such a regal, mm. graceful mm. presence. When she was on that screen, we both said, ooh. Okay, okay. Sad. And we made that face several times throughout the movie. Yeah, she several did. Several times. I forgot we went to go see that. We had lunch. We had a girl's go. We had to go get a drink. After yeah. the show. That's how good Angela was. I'm going to make an art. I'm going to say this. I feel like almost pretty much every role that Angela has done, could be considered Oscar worthy. She's so believable. She's so good. And the fact that they keep snubbing her, I'm feeling I'm starting to take the shit personally myself right now. Word. What does she have to do for y'all to give her her give her 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 Oscar? I mean, what more? What more? What's love got to do with it? Girl, My man. goodness. Oh, see, I was mad. I did that face with that one too, and they gave it to the child to play the damn piano. <laughs> Thanks. I'm glad that she did not even try to play it. She was like. Mm hmm she did. She gave that face, honey. And I, I loved her true reaction. I do. She looks so bomb, too. Like, she she, she's... Uh, Selena, what you think about this snub? I'm sick of it. Okay, so I started a little movie with Jamie Lee Curtis in it. And, Not the uh, little movie. <laughs> <laughs> the little called, movie. It's called Everywhere All at Once at the Same Time. Something like that. It's like a weird... It's a weird-ass movie. I saw it on the plane. And... um, you said it was good. Was it good? It, it was interesting, mm -hmm. but I will say this. Jamie Lee Curtis played a role that was totally and completely not something that you, you're used to her seeing. Mm -hmm. She was very good at it as well. However, I'm with Claudia and everybody else on this. Uh, you know, Angela should have got it for Tina Turner. And what's love Damn got to right. do with it? I mean, yep. that, I mean, let's be okay. honest. It's giving Denzel Washington when he didn't get it for Hurricane, when he didn't get it for Malcolm X. And then they're yes. going to give it to him for yes. training day. You know, so she'll probably do mm. something in the future that is less, la you know, that's less amazing. And then they'll give it to her then. I I, I thought she was fantastic in Black Panther. And she totally should have gotten it. She's gotten it in all the other war shows. So I didn't, I mean, whatever. It's, it seems like they like to give it to you when you play it totally against what you're usually doing. And then it's right. like, well, well, this is so different than what you've usually done. And I think Angela's almost a victim of her own success because she's played a bunch of different roles and she's excelled in every single one. So they're like, what else is new? You were bombing this. And or, fact, oh no. Well, can I tell y'all something? I had a very, very famous director tell me. Women get honored when they play roles where they're um, if, especially if they're beautiful and they're strong, when they're beat up, when they're mm -hmm. Raw, if you're too strong, 
too powerful, too beautiful. And Angela's a very beautiful woman by nature. They're like, well, nah, nah. And oh, right. like how we are, like, did you see her presence? Did you feel her? I did. did. It, it's so a double-edged sword, but you know, it would be unfortunate if she go play, got mud all over her face or look crazy that then they're like, oh, Oscar, she suffered. Right, if she played a slave, they'll probably want to give her the Oscar. Hell no. That part, Claudia. You know? That part. If she like, yes, they'd be like, oh, it was amazing. Oh, it was so moving. It was riveting. That's Uh, believable. Not riveting. Uh, Because because that's believable. Just like Denzel being a thug cop, that's believable. That's believable to me. No, to them. To them. That's believable to them. And you know who them is. Yeah. He was good in training you today when he said, Oh, you motherfucker. Oh, you did good, but I mean, you know, I mean you to this. y'all gonna do this to me. I mean, he was bombing. Yeah, but he was, everything, but he didn't bomb everything. Yeah. Her I like him. Him. Man, and I, I like still him. Think he's actually Malcolm X. It's him. He's Malcolm X. You know when Denzel got me? Glory when he got whipped the one. Oh, that one tear. I wanted to watch he, Claudia. I, w- I wanted to wipe that little tear. Right. Denzel, we got you, boo. Did he get supporting actress actor for that? Yeah, I believe he so. Did. He got okay. supporting actor for, for the slave. Stellar. <sighs> All right, y'all. Well, congrats. Well, Angela, you got the Oscar from us. Okay. That's right. Who you did, did the thing. Congratulations are in order for our girl Ruth E. Carter, who made history as the first black woman to win two Oscars. She won yes, the best yes. uh, costume designer award for her work on the Marvel sequel, Black Panther, Wakanda Forever. What are your thoughts on this historic moment from Ruth, Selena? I mean, she won it last year for the exact same movie. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And I, and maybe they just find that that's so fascinating that she can make these beautiful, amazing, colorful, fantastic, culturally uh, amazing, astounding costumes. I mean, let's be let's be clear. She deserves it. She does. But it's weird that you would give it to the costume designer and not the leading lady of the, the movie. That's just my personal opinion. I mean, they should have both got it. Consolation giving, prize. Let's give them something. Correct. It's, it's given that. Biff. But I'm happy for you. Either way. Okay, I'm gonna look like I'm frozen, y'all, but I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Okay. I feel just how you felt, Selena. And I love Ruth, and she does amazing Mm -hmm. work. But as soon as they announced it, I was like, Right. I'm telling you, last night, my face, I I, listen, I had a great time. I was at Byron Allen events. It was wonderful. Got to see Diane Ross sing last night, who I love. But my face last night was just a little shooketh. I was like, Oh, hmm. I watched it go from things being so right over here at the Golden Globes, where the right people were winning. Then we went to the uh, what was it, critics and all of that. Then they went to the BAFTAs, and to me, it was like the right people were winning that yes. everyone had been talking about. Then they went, came back, and then they did the Screen Actors Guild, and then it was like, eh. I have a theory. Tell me, I could, I could be off base. And I could be very much conspiracy theorist, (laughs) but I'm going to throw it out there. I feel like because of the slap, which was, we all know was very ghetto. (laughs) I feel like they decided to go back to the the corny right wing Anglo-Saxon-ish way (laughs) of the Oscars. And And that's what it gave me last night. I'm sorry I I watched it. From the very first award, and it kind of went that direction. I said, I know what's going to win tonight. You could you could feel it, you know. And I get it that they gave the brown people an opportunity in the change. Last year. And so they right. said this year, because, you know, there has also been some complaints that the Asians were being excluded um, and that they weren't getting their roles and things like that. So, you know... I, don't get me wrong. I'm very happy. Uh, the best actress, Michelle, she's been amazing. I loved her speech about don't let anyone ever tell you that you've reached your prime or count you out. I thought she was amazing. She'd been kicking ass for a long time. Hidden Tiger, or what is it, Hidden Tiger? Couch, she's been the bomb. Yeah, she's bad. She's dope. However, 
it just seemed very planned and not organic, in, in, in my opinion. Uh, that's why I'm saying, let's make up for it. The BT Awards, the Image Awards, the Lady of Soul Awards, the Soul Train Awards, the Bring Back like the Source playing, Awards. Though. I know, but we need to go to ours because they keep playing us and playing in our faces we like do, this. We do need to go, though, because they do play in our face. We do. Hey, need we, to, we need to go deep to all of our own award shows. We need to stop playing and not going. 